go for Sam Perkins. <laughs> David, can you introduce yourself? I'm Sam, uh, I work for Emilio Solar Energy. How's that? Domestic, commercial? Uh, so we do a lot of domestic and commercial installations for solar panels in schools, and we do battery installs and EV chargers. Oh, mainly like schools based, or is it a bit of a mix uh, of domestic say as well? Or? 80% or so is in schools, but okay. between when the schools are in, uh, are in off holiday, we do schools, and when it's in the school term, we do a lot of domestic. Okay, so you're coming up to the busy period with some holidays coming up. Yes, yeah, certainly, yeah. yeah, yeah. Next eight weeks or so, we're working in Birmingham doing a lot of EV chargers oh, um, imagine. in schools. And how did you get into that? Did you leave college straight into that? or did you do No, so I did my apprenticeship working for Befrangi in a steel forge doing maintenance. So I did a lot of uh, like breakdowns and uh, maintenance. Proper change from what yeah, you're doing so now. I always wanted to get into solar and I thought the change would be uh, appropriate just after, about six months after I qualified. So I'm six months into the new job and really enjoying it. Good variety or are you quite, or is it quite sort of all the same stuff and that's what you like? No, no, there's quite a lot of variety. Um, the difference between domestics, obviously I've never done that before, so I'm picking up all the domestic yeah. skills that I didn't pick up during my apprenticeship. The commercial, I picked up obviously a lot of the free face things in my last job but I'm definitely broadening my skills at this new job. Brilliant. Can, did you work, have you ever worked with much of BG or Luceco's gear before, before now? Um, I, I've put in a few BG sockets, outdoor ones, the IP rated ones, yeah. um, but because I don't do much lighting uh, with it being solar, I've not really used any of their stuff for, for lighting or anything like that. But did you, did you know they made such a variety of stuff? I mean, I know I didn't used to know they made extension no, leads for I a didn't realise they made the EV chargers, but they look really good. So I've taken a brochure to take that back to my work and, and show them what, what they have to offer now. Yeah, I mean, they definitely make some market, market leading stuff, car charger being one of them. And, and having, that, do you think having that relationship with a brand such as like Luceco is going to help you in, in work moving forward now you've been recognised by their awards? Certainly, yeah, yeah. Um, I think building up the relationships that I have over the, the day to day, that I'm going to take that back to my company and express how valuable that would be. Yeah, because I think, as, as you'll know, like I've learned since in, in the last couple of years that that relationship will, will, will only improve as, as time goes on. Like it starts, it's, today's day one, it, it, will, it will start and it will build. And, and you get invited to, to test stuff and, and, and see stuff. No, yeah. And I think it's, it'd, be, no, it'd, be be good, it'd be great yeah. for your career as well. No, definitely. So moving forward, do you um, think you might nominate anyone else for next year? Yeah. Uh, so I've got a few lads I work with now. Obviously, um, you don't have to spoil it. Don't tell no, them. No, I won't say the names. Them. And a few of the lads that I worked with last year at my old place, one of them got Apprentice of the Year at Lincoln College. So I think oh, he'd wow, be a yeah. brilliant nomination because he came... Hopefully from doing level two. He'll know, he'll know, he'll know who he is, but yeah, I won't mention any names. <laughs> Actually, thank you for your time. No worries, thank you very much. <laughs>